your own channel. Uh, this video is going to be hosted on my main channel and my second channel, which I recently created. No one knows about it because I have zero subscribers um, and no videos. So today we're doing a different style of video. Um, oh wow, that's, <laughs> it's like automatically zoomed in the camera. That's like very far away. That's like 30 centimeters away in real life, but it seems like it's right there. Speed Champions Koenigsegg Jesko. I'm gonna have to fix this, aren't I? I'll try to fix it. Um, I'm gonna be building it, and because, as I said in my last video, it's my birthday, 27th of May, um, I got a lot of Lego cards, and I'll show them at the end. You don't have to watch it, but uh, yeah, and I might upload like a GTA video today, tomorrow. Uh, Anyway, I'll this do a time lapse now so of building it. And if, uh, post you post can post skip post ahead by doing 10 seconds if you don't watch the time lapses of building it and you just want the review. <laughs> See you soon. Okay, yep, that was the intro. Now, here's the time lapse. And here, my sister just stopped recording, but all it is is the wheels. Really, just putting on the wheels. This is a tiny time lapse. Um, and as I will say in the next clip, um, that right headlight is wrong. They gave me one extra of that piece and one less of the piece it should be, and I've. Like, they should be shipping another one, a replacement part for it soon, so I'll try to fix that. That was the time lapse of the building. I thought it would be a lot longer, so I was actually going to put it in a different video where I'd have a link to it. But, um, no, I just rewatched it, and it was surprisingly quick, like 30 seconds long, maybe. And, um, in the time lapse, you would have seen that my sister came in and she pushed the button to stop time lapsing just as I was up to the wheels. So there was a little bit of like weird thing between them. Here's my first actual time holding the car. This is straight after finishing the time lapse. Um, so it's really cool all around. Uh, the exhaust. When I was building it, I actually at first thought this was the front. But then when I put that down, I was like, wait, isn't that the exhaust? So, I knew that was the back. Then, the spoiler, really cool. Um, and I was like, um, oh, it's been off to the side the whole time. I was like, because I was play placing glass pieces on the back here before I put on the spoiler. I was like, there's a lot of green under there, so the engine's supposed to look green. But then, the spoiler's covered it. So, yeah, um... The tail light, um, the diffuser, you can't really see it, it, I need a little more light, um, I could hold it, I'll just bring down the light that I turned on at the start of the time lapse, just a little lamp, um, Oh yeah, broken. See, will you do a spare minute, which probably won't be any time soon? Can you oh, set yeah, up the fine. PlayStation for the Disney Plus? Oh uh, yes. Now oh, yes, my sisters like to watch Disney Plus, and they can either watch it on their iPads or on PlayStation. Cause my my grandparents Samsung TV, which is the same one as ours, as has Disney Plus, but ours doesn't. So I have to set up my PlayStation to put on Disney Plus. Um, okay, now now you can see it. The diffusers, um, cool vents, and then, yeah, the exhaust goes under, like an under view of the car, um, yeah, 
So then there's the really cool. So it's white all around. And yeah, that I'll have to fix that because it gave me instead of like I think it gave me one less of uh, this and one extra of that, like that piece there. So I, I'll have to try to fix that by by um, pick a, from pick a brick on Lego.com. I'll have to get that and um, I'll place it. But that's all that'll do for now. Um, uh, the interior is really cool in my uh, um, opinion. The smooth like up pieces, like the smooth pieces, um, and then that goes onto some smooth plates. Really nice. Um, the rear part is the vents. I, I believe there would be vents. Just go written on it. Vince Jesco, then there's more Vince probably. Story about this car and how I got it. Um, I was actually at Kmart today, which is like Target and stuff for American people, Walmart. Um, and they hadn't stocked this onto the shelves yet, but I was like, isn't this car like brand new? And I remember this is this came out a few days ago, and I thought. I haven't done videos on my old car, like on my other cars I got for my birthday because they're like older and wouldn't like really get cared about because that was from years ago. Oh yeah, that, that vent too there, that's just cool. Um, so then I grabbed it off the shelf and I used some of my birthday money that I got from my friends and my, my, and my dad and my mum and stuff uh, to buy this. Um, and yeah, so they hadn't even stocked it yet, I just saw it on like a trolley thing that they got from out the back and I was just like hey hey boy and I yoinked it and um yeah so I'll sh I'll set up like all my Lego cars that I got for my birthday and the three other ones I've gotten before that um yeah so I'll just show that like a little bit at the end you can go now if you don't care about all my other cars and it's just here for the Jesco um this is this will also be on my second channel if I, I think I've already said that, but yeah, I'll post this on um, my main channel and the second channel, but then other videos like this with the Lego and vaults and stuff, I'll, I'll all put on the second channel, I'm just putting this on both so you know. Um, anyway, yeah, I'll set up that now. And here we go for the last part. collection that I got for my birthday. Um, I'll try to make this quick so the video is already quite long from what I've seen from all the links of all the videos put together. So this is the 1985 Audi Quattro um, S1. This is the Lamborghini Urus SDX. This is the, um, the Lamborghini Huracan Super Trophio Evo. I really like it, so it's got a bit of gold and black. Um, here's the Nissan GTR. Hang on, look at the back of it. It's got the classic tail lights. Cool exhaust. What a color. No, you stay on there, Mr. I'll fix you up here a bit. I'm going to fix you. Oh, I'll probably wish I would at the end of all of it. Alright, the back of all the cars in the end of the video on the sides. But here is the Connie's Egg Jesco, which this video is about. Um, here's the McLaren Senna GTL with McLaren doors. It's awesome. You can get up and down. Here is the Lego drag stuff, not a real car, not space stuff like that, so it's not like, it doesn't have a name. And then the Alfaro buggy, which, um, which is like, you can tell by the app and probably the best or something, but it's not a real car. 
And um, that's where I have that I said I was going to include. Um, the Don Dodge Charger from Fast and Furious, the Corvette ZR1, and the Dodge Gear Rally car. There wasn't much space to fit it all in, so I just stuck with one day off my birthday. There's eight um, so far. There's some that are available near me, because not many of these are available near me, and there's some very nice that sort of came up. Um, I might get like a Ferrari F8 Tributo, which is also a speed champion at this scale. Um, like these. Oh, and really quickly, back of this looks like that. Like cool, um, wild body events, end events, what do you call them? Here's the back of the Liam Lewis, I think it's pronounced Lewis. Um, Lewis, uh, Lewis, that sounds Scottish, but I'm from Scottish family partially. Um, there's the Awesome Trepia Evo with like the awesome exhaust and the gold. Yeah, um, I'm not looking where I'm going, I'm looking by the camera. You've already seen the back of this one. And uh, yes, so I would have already shown, but he's just like that. And um, I like the tail when I introduce it, so. So much, you can't really see them. So it's getting damn dark. But it's too light. Anyway, and then the cool piece Anyway, um, yeah, hope you enjoyed the video. Very long, I think. And, um, yeah, if you like other videos like this, it'll be on the second channel. See ya! Yes indeed, old me, me from yesterday. See ya.